Hello. I uh, realized that uh, this word, monkeypox, has started to appear in the news. It appeared in the news about uh, two weeks ago, on Twitter at least. That's where I first came across it. That there was a case of one man from Nigeria in the UK, and that man was already identified, and he was kept under medical supervision. And now two weeks later, there is news that the monkeypox virus has spread to different countries in Europe, and there's also monkeypox in the United States of America. Now I know since this news has just appeared, or relatively new, already one can see in the conspiracy theory circles all sorts of viewpoints with great details is being advanced. Now, I am not going to go over what those views are and uh, what the conspiracy theorists are willing to believe, although you may have a very good idea of what they are thinking, you notice that there is a certain underlying thought process and distrust is a major, major part of what shapes the narrative in conspiracy theory circles. And every once in a while, they're going to be proven right. And because they're proven right from time to time, it legitimizes that one reason, and even if it invalidates 10 others, they will focus on the one where they are vindicated. So I am not going to go into details of what they're saying, I have just opened two web pages of organizations that they particularly dislike and distrust. So I am looking at, first of all, a, the web page on the cdc.gov, and there's a section called About Monkeypox, and I'm going to read from there, and I will leave the links in the video description so you can visit on your own and you can read them actually let me read from the beginning and then i will go to this page so there's a page on the cdc website separately for monkeypox it says here monkeypox was first discovered in 1958 when two outbreaks of a pox-like disease occurred in colonies of monkeys kept for research. Hence the name monkeypox. The first human case of monkeypox was recorded in 1970 in the Democratic Republic of Congo during a period of intensified effort to eliminate smallpox. Since then, monkeypox has been reported in humans in other Central and Western African countries. Now, let's go to the section or the page about monkeypox. Monkeypox is a rare disease that is caused by infection with monkeypox virus. Monkeypox virus belongs to the arthropoxvirus genus in the family Poxviridae. The Arthropox virus genus also includes variola virus, which causes smallpox, vaccinia virus used in the smallpox vaccine, and cowpox virus. Monkeypox was first discovered in 1958 when two outbreaks of a pox-like disease occurred in colonies of monkeys kept for research hence the name monkeypox. The first human case of monkeypox was recorded in 1970 in the Democratic Republic of the Congo, DRC. During a period of intensified effort to eliminate smallpox, 
Since then, monkeypox has been reported in people in several other Central and Western African countries, Cameroon, Central African Republic, Côte d'Ivoire, Democratic Republic of the Congo, Gabon, Liberia, Nigeria, Republic of the Congo, and Sierra Leone. The majority of infections are in Democratic Republic of the Congo. <coughs> Excuse me. There is an image of a child covered in blisters, a child affected with monkeypox on this page. So I'm going to leave the link. If you want to visit the page, you can see an image of that child. Looks terrible. Monkeypox cases in people have occurred outside of Africa linked to international travel or imported animals, including cases in the United States, as well as Israel, Singapore, and the United Kingdom. The natural reservoir of monkeypox remains unknown. However, African rodents and non-human primates like monkeys may harbor the virus and infect people. Now, I'm going to go to the website of the WHO, and they have a page dedicated to monkeypox, and it's quite likely some of the information would be repeated. It's available in different languages. This page has been here since 9 December 2019, and I'm going to read first the key facts. Monkeypox is caused by monkeypox virus, a member of the arthropox virus genus in the family Poxveridae. Monkeypox is a viral zoonotic disease that occurs primarily in tropical rainforest areas of Central and West Africa and is occasionally exported to other regions. Monkeypox typically presents clinically with fever, rash, and swollen lymph nodes. Monkeypox virus is mostly transmitted to people from wild animals such as rodents and primates but human-to-human -human transmission also occurs. Monkeypox virus is transmitted from one person to another by contact with lesions, body fluids, respiratory droplets, and contaminated materials such as bedding. This is very, very important to keep in mind, how it is transmitted. Typically, up to a tenth of persons ill with monkeypox may die, with most deaths occurring in younger age groups. The clinical presentation of monkeypox resembles that of smallpox, a related arthropox virus infection, which was declared eradicated worldwide in 1980. Vaccinia vaccine used during the smallpox eradication program was also protective against monkeypox. A new third-generation vaccinia vaccine has now been approved for prevention of smallpox and monkeypox. Antiviral agents are also being developed. This is as far as I'm going to read on this page. This page has then details on every one of these points, and you will have a link for this page also in the video description. I encourage you to visit and read the rest of the information for yourself. If there's something you need to download, I believe there's also a link at the bottom of the page under documents, monkey pox data collection toolbox, final. There's a 111 kbyte, kilobyte uh, document, probably in PDF format, which you can download if you want to. So that is all the time I want to spend on this. And uh, thank you for your time and attention. I'll see you another time. Goodbye.